In this class, we are going to create collapsible component over here. Let me minimize this layout. From the components, we have to select collapsible. Drag this and drop it over here. I could see this collapsible icon. Now, if I switch over to the live mode, you will have an option to expand this. Switch over to design. Switch over to code. And let's check how it has created this. Now under collapsible, I will create a form layout as I want to get the search criteria from the user. So for that, I am selecting this form layout and dropping it over here. Go back to design. So this collapsible layout is having this expanded to off. We can turn it to true so that it will always be expanded and we can see the form layout. So if you make this as off, this will always be off unless the user prompts it to expand the collapsible. I will add few fields over here in order to get the data from the user. So before that, let me style this collapsible. Switch over to the code. Select this div section and go over to all. Here, if you expand the general attributes, you will find the style. You can directly write here in the code or else you can make use of this style. Now I will add the background color to white background color has been added switch over to design as you can see we are seeing this background color getting highlighted to white now i will try to add the margin at the top select this or else we can write it over here directly margin top is 10 px now switch over to design as you can see there is a margin added at the top that is 10 px this you can change anytime this got turned to off let me turn it back to true yeah expandable is turned to true now switch over to code and check the details yeah this looks fine now before the form layout i will try to add the heading so i will search for heading over here and drag and drop it over here next to collapsible I mean within the collapsible but before form layout and I will bind this form layout within the flex field I will search for flex over here flex container and drop it next to next to headings and I will remove this form layout from here and add it within div. Let me format this document. In order to format, right click and click on this format document. This will format the document if it is not formatted. Now we have to select this heading. I will change the level to H6 over here. Now instead of heading, I will rename this to search criteria. Now let me go back to design. The web page looks something like this. Now let us preview how the web page looks in the bigger screen. So this has opened our web page. Let me expand the collapsible. So let's now check we had enabled this collapsible to true. It's not reflecting. So we need to select this check mark over here. Then it will add it into the HTML code. Yeah, as you can see our expanded is set to true now. Now let me refresh and check whether collapsible is always expanded or not. Yeah, now when the page refreshes, the collapsible is always expanded. Now before closing this class, let me select this heading and select the slot type to header. Now it will rearrange accordingly. If you select to default, as you can see it was coming over here. As soon as we select header, it will rearrange accordingly. So in our next class, we will populate this form layout to accept the criteria from the user. Like the employee ID and we will add one more criteria that is to search based on salary.